now let's move on to the next topic margin of safety what do you mean by margin of safety so margin of safety simply means the difference between budgeted sales volume minus break even sales volume otherwise we can say projected sales volume minus break even sales volume it's basically let's say the budgeted sales volume budgeted sales units are 8000 units and your break even sales units are 5000 units so that will be 8000 minus 5000 will be 3000 so that will be your margin of safety it is sometimes expressed as a percentage of the budgeted sales volume so how do you calculate that so budgeted sales volume minus break even sales volume divided by budgeted sales volume times the percentage so thereby you can calculate the margin of safety now let's take an example in order to calculate in order to explain the margin of safety AGPLC makes and sells a product which has a variable cost of fifteen thousand dollars and which sells for twenty thousand dollars budgeted fixed cost are thirty five million budgeted sales are eight thousand units now to calculate margin of safety so what do you need you need budgeted sales volume which is eight thousand units and you need break even sales volume so that we need to identify we need to calculate break even sales units so how do you calculate break even sales units simply you take the fixed cost 35 million divided by contribution per unit so how much is the contribution per unit which is the selling price selling price minus variable cost per unit so 20,000 minus 15,000 will be 5,000 so just calculate the break-even point which will be fixed cost divided by contribution per unit so which will be 35 million divided by 5,000 per unit that will give you 7,000 units as break-even point sales so you need to make 7000 units in order to break even so now we calculated the break even sales volume as well now let's calculate the margin of safety so margin of safety is equal to budgeted sales volume minus break even sales volume divided by budgeted sales volume times 100 so that will give you 8000 was our budgeted sales units and break even sales units 7000 we calculated here divided by again the budgeted sales volume so we need to express the difference as a percentage of the budgeted or the projected sales volume so that will be how much 12.5 percent so what does this mean what does this 12.5 percent means so that indicates this indicates that if budgeted sales fall short by 1000 units now see now the break-even point is 7000 your budgeted expected uh, sales volume is 8000 if it falls short of 1000 units by 1000 units or 12.5 percent 12.5 percent on 8000 will be 1000 then the AGPLC will make no profit at all so currently the budgeted sales are 8000 units so if it falls to 7000 which means 
by 1000 units the ag plc will make no profit